Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. You need to say that name in the Holy Ghost. <laughs> oh man, Jesus is Lord. <laughs> Jesus Lord. <laughs> you need to say that in the Holy Ghost. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, Jesus is Lord. <laughs> it true in your life? <laughs> Are you stamped with the seal of approval? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, you need to do it. <laughs> You're approved by the Father when you got Jesus <laughs> in your forehead. <laughs> oh, man. You don't got to tie a little box with scriptures in it, Doc. <laughs> you can take your phylacteries off. Oh, we have the mind of Christ. And Jesus is Lord. <laughs> Lord, we have the mind of Christ. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. When Jesus is Lord, we have the mind of Christ. When Jesus is Lord, we have the way. We know the way. And we can walk in the way. Jesus is Lord, hallelujah. Whoa. Jesus is Lord. <laughs> uh, he's Lord of He's Lord of your problems. <laughs> he's Lord of your solutions. He's Lord of all the problems and the solutions. He's the navigator. Oh, we can cast all of our cares upon our Lord because He cares for us. That caring, He's taking care of us when He's our Lord. Hallelujah. You don't gotta fret, you don't gotta freak out. Oh, the only thing that needs to come out is working out your salvation of the Lordship of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let Him come through your forehead. Hallelujah. <laughs> And everything you touch. Oh, 
God, he didn't want it to be 666. He wanted it to be 333, the mind of Christ. Everything you put your hand to, <laughs> let it be the hand of the Lord going through your hand. Hallelujah, body of Christ. <laughs> oh, shaka. Jesus, I learned something really cool today. I was looking at my daughter and I saw myself in her. I liked it. <laughs> you know, the father's really, I think she really likes it when he sees himself in his kids too, you know. He wants to see his kids full of life, full of a life-giving spirit. You know what God does? He just pours his spirit upon all flesh. Well, he's resting on his throne. Hallelujah. You can sit with him in his throne and let him pour his spirit through your spirit upon all flesh, too. <laughs> Hallelujah. You know, the first Adam screwed up, but the second Adam's a life giving spirit, and we're in him. We're made in his image. Come on. Manifesting the nature of God the Father in the Son. Hallelujah. He glorified the name of Jesus on the earth. Jesus glorified the Father by manifesting his names and natures and spirit while he walked the earth. And God said to his son, I will both glorify it and glorify it again, speaking of his name. Because he glorified his name through Jesus the Son and he's going to glorify his name through the body of Christ when the headship of Jesus rests on his body and Jesus is Lord by the Holy Ghost pouring through the full body he's gonna glorify his name through his the body of Jesus come on I both glorified it and I will glorify it again he didn't say this for my sake he said it for your sake <laughs> he said it for the sake of those standing around Jesus that day Come on, Jesus is Lord. It's not just a phrase, it's a reality. It's a tangible shaka ding dang dong, ka bing bang bong that you can smoke and release as you exhale the kingdom of heaven. <laughs> breathe in that fresh Zion air and breathe out the Prince of Peace upon all the dead souls around you and watch them come alive. <laughs> they might snap and growl at you like a wounded animal underneath the car, you know, hasn't eaten for a couple days, got a few wounds on them, a little bit scared, but you gotta trap them with the nets of peace. <laughs> but you bring the nets to Jesus, you don't bring them into a building, a prison system, you bring them right to Jesus, the living God. Oh, Shaka. You trap them in kindness. You trap them in the peace of God that passes all of it. Whoa, where am I right now, Lord? Okay. <laughs> I thought. <laughs> oh, yeah. I. <laughs> Is still on the earth, but man, I feel really high in the most high God right now. <laughs> oh, you know that we are literally seated with Christ in heavenly places far above the earth realm. The anointing will come to break the yoke of the natural mindset so that you can have the mind of Christ and have your mind set in heavenly places. <laughs> Just rested and nestled at the breast of Jesus. Come on. Oh. Hallelujah. Just like John the Beloved, you can feel the rhythm of heaven. The King of Glory just pulsating the waves of glory right through John's ear gate. Filling him with hope and peace so that he can draw on those when he goes through his trials, when they're trying to boil him in oil, try to murder him.